Hello guys and welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to show you how you can close a ticket on Zendesk. So in order to do that, open up your web browser and then just log in into your Zendesk account. When you have reached your dashboard, go at the top right corner and click at the 4 box icon and then just click at admin center. Then after reaching admin center, go at object and rules, then scroll down until you find automations. This is the page where you will find all of your tickets. So just open up a ticket and after your ticket is open you can see all the conditions that you have to meet in order to close the ticket the first is ticket status which is currently open so i will click on the drop box and click solved next is ticket hours since solved which is 48 so meaning of this section is in how many hours the ticket will get solved as you can see this is already set to 48 but i will change it into 98 then after completing this you can just go at the bottom column which says perform this action in which you will find your ticket status which is currently open so i will just click at the drop down button and select closed and after that i will just click submit and this is how you close a ticket but there is also another way you can close a ticket and that will be a trigger so let me show you how you can do that so you can just go and click at triggers just above automation so after you reach the trigger page click on add trigger and then you can make certain conditions for a scenario so let me give you a demonstration of how this works so i will take it for example trigger name ticket for youtube then you can add any type of description if you like after that i will set a category and the category name will be set trigger then down below i will add few conditions so let's say from is then i will choose a simple ticket form then again i will add condition VIA update VIA is email then I will add another condition in which it will be the number of incidents is greater than 10 and after you have filled this column if there is any ticket meeting all of this condition it will be closed but right now the trigger is not in action because we haven't given one so just scroll down go to actions and add an action then select status and closed now after you have created the action the trigger system will automatically close a ticket for you so in order to save this just click on create and there you have it a trigger is set and now if there is any ticket meeting all the conditions it will automatically get closed and that's it thank you for watching and do like and subscribe to my channel and take care